Hello guys, this is Amos Stone Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play I Am Balling, I Am Faded song, okay? It's actually the Boa Duvet song, okay? So give you a preview of the section that you can learn, it goes like this. Alright, let's get right into it. So melody and chords, that's the foundation. And afterwards, you can add your improvisations and decoration patterns like that to make your own version. Let's get right into it. So right hand starts on the B up here. Middle C is here for reference. We go up two octaves of the C's up here and up here. It's just the B right below that. Okay, so that's where we start for the right hand. So let's break it up to two parts. It's easier to learn. So the first part, right hand starts on the B there. And then A down to E twice. And then repeat this again a e e so those are the eight notes for the first part okay essentially just four notes played twice so b a e e twice like that for the right hand okay left hand we have three chords these three chords are important because both parts are these three chords in this particular order so it's e minor which is e g b fully white note chord second chord is then b minor which is b d f sharp and then third chord is G major, which is G, B, D, fully white note chord as well. Okay, so with these three chords in mind, you can go to the G major down here as well. Up to your personal preference of what sound you like better. So anyway, two hands together for this first part goes like this. So right hand starts with the B, A, E, up to the first E, E minor by itself. And the right hand continues with the second E. And then B and B minor together. After that E. G major by itself, and the right hand with the next E by itself, like that. There you go. So let's learn it again. It goes here, together, here, like that. There you go. Now moving on to the second part, right hand continues. Once again, it goes B, A, E, E, but now it changes. D, 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 G, A, F sharp. That's it for the right hand for the second part. Okay, let's learn it again. It goes B, A, E, E, D, 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 G, A, F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have the same three chords as the first part. So just E minor, B minor, and then G major again. As I said, very useful to remember those three chords from the first part. Now that you don't need to remember it for the second part. Okay, so right hand starting here. And then D and B minor together. G and G major together. Like that. There you go. Let's learn it again. So it goes here. Together. There you go. Here. Together. Together. Like that. Okay? So you can do it together or not together for the G major if you want. Just up to your personal preference. But anyways, that's that. So back to back. The two parts we've learned this lesson will be played like this. And you just repeat it. Okay? So alternate the two parts. Yeah, you can play with a with the A as well for the G major. It sounds alright like that as well. Yeah, just play with the A instead of the G. Okay? The there like that. Okay, so yeah, that's it. So once you get the melody and block chords version of this all good, you can start to add your own improvisations and decoration patterns to make your own version. Left hand, you could do octave bass and arpeggios. Rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing. The right hand, you can harmonize it on the chords to make it thicker in texture. Play around. Yeah, play around and have fun, okay? So yeah, 
that's pretty much it so i hope you enjoyed this lesson by the way if you want to learn other awesome tunes like this search up your favorite song name followed by amos doll in the youtube search to find those other lessons to learn for yourself as well if you want to learn more piano from me you can learn from me from my website bestpianomethod.com linked in the description to check out my website including my piano courses memberships books and services so make sure to check it out if you're a piano enthusiast once again it's bestpianomethod.com linked in the description check it out but as for now that's pretty much it for today's lesson